Hello everyone, welcome back to the room. So the last thing I did was open up this chamber here. So let's go ahead and look at it and figure out what's going on. By the way, I'm pretty sure that I'm nearing the end. Because I think this game lasts about two hours, and I've actually already spent about two hours. So I'm probably pretty close to the end. Plus if you look at the notes, um... Four of seven, wasn't there a five of seven somewhere? I think I read a five of seven as well, maybe it was inside of here. Or inside of the drawer? Yeah, five of seven, so... I think there's only two notes left, which would probably mean the end of the game. Okay, so... What's going on here? Hmm. I think I need a light to be coming through here. Like, the light is over here, but it doesn't actually seem to be coming out of this hole. It's gotta be some sort of reflection, modification sort of thing where you're supposed to reflect the light in some way. But, um, it doesn't actually do anything at the moment. Okay, so if this does nothing, then what do I do? Because I have nothing in my inventory. So I just put this lens on. Mm -hmm. Is this up here connected to it in some way? No, focus on the sides of the box, okay. So not time for that yet. And there is still this, which still needs to be activated, and the password for that is accessed from here, but it doesn't seem to be complete yet. So I would need something to indicate which of these blocks to click on, but nothing here does. They're just empty. So that is not helpful. Oh, hello. Okay, something is coming out. Cool. Alright, here we go. Okay, so I can't control this one. This one I can reflect... Two different ways. So what's the end goal? Where do I want this to hit? I'm guessing here? Hmm. Well... Obviously, I just needed to hit all of them. Which that does not do. Hmm, that's better. Ooh. Actually, wait, is it? Yeah, there we go. Okay. We have power. Whoa. That is beautiful. Oddly shaped piece of map, part of South America. Holy crap, look at that. I wish I could just stop focusing on the table and look up at the sky. Or the, the room, rather. The sky on the room. Overlaid upon it. That is gorgeous. Alright. See if I can get a new present. Hopefully this one isn't as disappointing as the last. Come on. Ah, oh, damn it. Okay, well, I'm guessing now that this is lit up, I'm probably going to be able to see something through here that will tell me what to press. Yes. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. Um, just make a four by four grid. Hmm, hmm, hmm. I am terrible at making grids, but uh, no, that's good enough. That one, and 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 that one. Okay. A square piece of map. 
Uh, six of seven. This might end very, very soon. August 9th. The circle were right all along. How could I have been so blind? I have discovered a passage in their scriptus... Noch? Knock? Knock? Knock die? Is that a T and an I? I think it's... Yeah, I think it's knock die. In incantation, lacking the energy source to drive it. Well, I have such a source. This night, I summon Astaroth, whom the Babylonians called Ishtar, Prince of Accusers and Inquisitors, and he who can discover all secrets. Once correctly bound, all knowledge of the null element can be mine. I can barely contain myself. There's so much to prepare. Um, I'm sorry, I Ishtar? Prince of Accusers and Inquisitors. Remember the Inquisition? That wasn't very pleasant, was it? Yes, the Inquisition can discover all secrets. Uh, well, I don't know about that, but they can certainly invent all secrets. Right, well, have fun unlocking Ishtar and having him inquisit upon your body. <laughs> I just thought, wouldn't it be funny if I got to the center of this thing and I found, like, the head of the person who had been sending me these notes? Like, I just find him inside of here? Let's pull it. What's the worst that could happen? Chapter complete. Okay, so now we're completely done with the side, aren't we? Yep, completely done. Can't even focus on it. Okay, so that is all irrelevant. Everything on the top is what matters. Okay. What's going on here? Large circular indentation. Does this thing spin? Indentation? It doesn't really look like an indentation to me. I guess it's talking about the thing inside of this thing. It's kind of an indentation, a very small one. Right, well, I don't think I can do anything with that yet. Right, that ball is just creating this image around me. Can't touch it. Is that a button? Uh, I, think it needs, I think something needs to be placed there. All right, what's going on in the center? A small slit in the exact center of the table. Ooh, hold on. Yeah, there's a bunch of arrows. Okay, what do those arrows point to? Hmm, there's some numbers up there. 55. Five, 10, 15, 20. So this one points to both, this points both ways. All these only point outwards. Can I spin this or something? Doesn't seem like it. Oh, wait a minute, what's this? This looks like something I could spin over here, but I can't click it. Oh, here we go. Hmm, what's this? A small socket. Yeah, it looks like I could spin this, but I can't actually reach it.
Alright, here's a doodad. Okay, line these three plates up, I guess. Like that? Oh, no, wait, that lines that one up, but not the others. Oh, they spin at different rates. Okay. Yeah, so I just gotta spin until they're all aligned. Gotcha. Or, wait a minute. Oh, wait, that opened up, didn't it? Oh. That's it? They didn't even quite line up. Okay. A brass winding handle. Seven of seven, oh god. I think we're very, very close to the end. August 15th. Something is wrong. I followed the incantation to the very letter. Astaroth did not appear. There are no answers to be had. More questions. The visions have increased. They gather. They gather to me, and I cannot stay in one place for long. I try to monitor them, but the lens hurts my eyes. I have mixed a solution for the pain. For those that follow and find this journal, I lack the power to describe this. There is no concept within the human sphere with which to explain it. The house is so much larger now. There are rooms everywhere. <laughs> okay. You know, there really should be a button that just says, get the fuck out of here and burn the house down behind you. Because I don't think I want to open it anymore. I mean, in terms of, like, character... But in terms of my in-universe reaction, my in-universe reaction would be to run away. Of course, my reaction is to keep getting inside because, hey, puzzles are fun to solve. Whee! Alright, what can I crank? Hmm... This thing? Okay. Ah, we do it that way. Okay. Hello? Non est ad astromalis e terraris v. There's that thing again. Buttons! Okay, so I press the button and it just goes to one thing and I can't change it. So it's stuck on this. It's stuck on a constellation of a sword. Hello? Hmm. The sword. The table. There's a painting back there. At least I think that's a painting. It looks like some... Aztec figurine, or Aztec carving, rather. Okay. It's not really lining up to be anything. Can I move this? I guess I need to put something in the center to move it, probably. At least that's what it feels like. There are still those numbers in the background. Right. The sword. The sword. The sword. What about this thingy? Still have nothing for it. Oh, I can zoom in here? Oh. There we go. Well, in that case... Well, still 
doesn't really forming anything. Oh! <laughs> I can move it. I guess I have very long arms. Okay. Where did you come from, my lovely? Ornate Ancient Dagger. You know, this is starting to seem like some sort of a sacrificial altar. Oh. Hello. You weren't there before. I should probably write that down. 3x4 grid. Okay, got it. Whoops. Clicked out of the game again. Okay, well, I'm guessing the sword goes here. Whoa. Hello. Astral bodies. Okay, well, I just wrote down what the answer to this is. Did that work? Okay, looks like it did. Time for a different one. It looks like the gear is starting again. Okay. What's next? We have the sword, or we had the sword, now we have the eye. This thing is beautiful. Mmm. Fruit. That one's an apple. That one's like a grapefruit. This is like a squash. Is a squash a fruit? Is that a fruit? I have no idea. Anyway, it's uh, not too important at the moment. I must make note of this. Squash is fruit? Question mark. Here we go. Got it in my notes. Just in case. You never know. Okay, the eye. The eye. Oh. There's another one. Oh shit, there's a bunch of stuff going on here. Okay, well let's write this one down. I don't need to make a grid. It's pretty simple. There we go. Yeah. Let's write some dots. Okay. So I need to like make these stop, right? At just the right point? Or something? Hold on, what is, what is in the background? This does seriously look like a sacrificial site. gold amulet. Probably goes here. Mm -hmm. Okay, now we can move that. Okay. Right, so we still have those arrows, but where do I point them?
I mean, I'm guessing one arrow has to be pointing towards this arrow. So I suppose the question is, which one? I guess just try them all. Alright, that looks right. Oh, it's like a castle or something. Alright, so which way does the castle need to be facing? I don't know, but probably a different way from that way. Let's actually turn it 180. Is there, like, something special painted on its side, at a certain angle? I don't get it. There's like a hole here, which I don't... Is that there normally? No. What's up with this? Are there more of them? Not that I can see. Okay, well, it's still pointing to the eye. I don't know if that matters anymore. Is there, like, an eye in the constellation somewhere? Don't see it. Yeah, I'm not sure what I'm supposed to be doing with this. I do not understand. Is it related to the number of windows in the castle thingy? There's two on that side. There's two on the side with a single arrow. Does that matter? Why would that matter? There's a hole there, but... Maybe it just needs to point out the hole? Why would it need to point at the hole? I don't know. Well, that's a pretty good pointing. Maybe it needs to point at the whole end at the other thing, so like... Well, no, here would be pointing at... No, I guess not.
Okay, okay, so there's two on the bottom here. You know, there are four layers to the castle. One, two, three, four, and there are four arrows. Think it means something? In fact, I'm almost certain it means something. But there's six sides. Well, some of the sides don't have any. Any holes. Let's get a look at all the holes. So there's two up top. Was it up top? Alright, so there's two on that level. And then, oops. And then if you keep going, there's one on the top level. Uh, maybe the sides with the arrows are the only ones that actually have any windows. Because that's the first arrow there. There's one. Yeah, there's two more. Yeah, okay, so the sides of the arrows are the ones with the windows. Okay, what does that mean, though? What, like, what does that matter? Right, I'm gonna keep working at this, and I'll be right back. Clever, clever, clever. Okay, I got it. So, what do we have here? Well, I just realized we have a 3x4 grid. You can see there's these slots. One, two, three. Horizontally. And then, of course, up and down you have four slots, and what resembles a 3x4 grid? Well, this thing does. So, yeah, I just need to piece them all together. So, bottom level is... Outside two. Next one up is the middle. very top one is also the middle. One from the top is the outside too. Okay. Gotcha. It's a cool little puzzle. I like it. Wait. Oh, shit. I was looking at the wrong one. Whoops. I was looking at the uh, previous one I wrote down. Oh, that's the device that uh, channels the energy? Is that the null element? The energy source harnessing the null element. It is. Look at it. Grab it. I want to touch it. What does it feel like? Is it warm? Is it cold? Alright, what's the next one? This one is a thingy. I have no idea what that is. Okay, then. It, uh, seems we're stuck here. <laughs> Wonderful. Right. Looking up in the sky. No. Nope. Nothing with my special lens. Okay, I'm guessing I can rotate these? Yes. Ok, 
Okay, so this bottom piece is un uh, immobile, so let's move everything else to accommodate it. There we go. There's the symbol again. Upon which I place this. Okay, so I think I just fed it. Chapter complete. Now what? Okay, now I've just outright entered a completely different dimension, I think. Oh crap, what did that say? I skipped it. A land of... Marble flooring and huge gears. A queer sense of movement. Not quite turning, not quite falling. I felt myself cross the threshold, and the visions abated. Perhaps they only serve to drive me to this place? The route back closes behind me, but a way forward opens ahead. Something is drawing me on. In case you are with me, I will try to guide you along the path. I pray you never came. I pray you are just another of my dreams. I noticed there's some piano notes up here. Might be important. A notepad with a sketch of the null element. Hmm. Ah. Something is out of place. That's so cool. A small gear. Hmm, what's this? Looks like there's a gear missing. Alright, so there's two gears missing. This one is triangular shaped in the center, so this one probably goes here. Cool. Hmm? What? Hmm. What's this little thing here? Looks like a guitar pick. Alright, let's mess with that in a second. I want to see if there's something else. Let's scout out the environment some more. Keyhole. Okay. Hmm. Looks like this opens. Actually, oh no, they all have that same thing. It's just a, a latch for the whole top. Notes. Those well, are notes. Musical notation. Okay, so music is definitely going to be irrelevant, since there's some music there and there's some music here. Socket, keyhole, Music, music. Oh, hello. Limited edition English drum table. The hell's a drum table? Hmm. 
So I noticed this one is lit up, kind of. It's got like a differently colored wood. Okay, and these have the number of symbols. Uh, these have one, two, and three on them, which is also present here. One, two. Actually, no, there's no three. There's only a one and a two. Hmm. Let's make sure there's no more secret dingle dangles. Two small holes suggesting something's missing. What is this? Three symbols, you don't say. Is that the symbols? So, S, squiggle, and pyramid? Hold on, I gotta get them right. Okay, so, uh, one is pyramid. Two is squiggle, squiggle. And three is S. This one's just missing. Okay, one is pyramid. Two is this thing. And three is S. A coin. Huh. Thought it was a gear. Now I'm just super suspicious about every single part of this wood. So many differently colored spots in the wood. Which suggests things are waiting to pop out. So I suppose it doesn't go here, does it? Nope. The hell do I do with a coin? Well, that's not gonna work. Alright, let's give this thing a shot. Okay, so if I let go of it, it goes all the way back to the beginning. And does it follow the pathway I went? Let's see. It does. So it looks like the goal is to go past every single one only once. And maybe return it back to the beginning in the same state? Okay. Let's see. So here, here, here. Oh, I got it. Okay. Easy enough. Okay. Uh, do I just let it go? No, okay. No, it doesn't go back the way you came. It just goes back like the shortest route. Okay, so that makes it a little bit tougher. What if I just grab everything really, really fast? <laughs> Like, like, no offense, but if you actually think about this, you could just hold this thing here with one hand and just grab this stuff with the other hand. Grab things! No. Okay. Right. I don't know what's up with these one and two things, though. Like, why is one lit and the other not? Okay, hold on. Hmm... And that's not going to work. So this gets them all. And then it goes down and it hits two. Mm. What if I was here? Okay, so let's try this. This is actually quite difficult. 
Um. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. No, I think I have it. No. No, actually, I don't think I do. No, that's not going to work. Hmm. I hope I'm not misunderstanding the puzzle. I'm pretty sure this is what you're supposed to do. Okay. No, that's not going to work. God damn it. What if I just, like, flip around here a couple times? Oh, well, pff, there you go. Wait, what? Why'd you go back? Okay. Um, right, what, what? Okay, so those things open up. I don't even know what those things are, by the way. And they're opening up at these pick things. But what are they? Oh, wait a minute. Hold on. Oh. Oh. It's a notch that I can go into. Bingo! What are you? A metal orb? There's something strange about it. There's something strange about every single thing going on and every single thing I've seen and every single thing I've touched.